What is going on guys, we are back in our experimental area, so today we are going to be looking at alpha maps, making them and how to apply them in Unreal Engine. So we have a fence here and we have leaves and they are all completely flat planes but they just have alphas on them to give them shape and to make them transparent where they need to be. For example this fence looks like it's transparent in all of these little gaps. Alright, so let's get started on how to do that. I'm going to go over to our independent plane over here and start working on getting that done. So, if we go online quick, we can find the texture, and I've just written fence texture seamless, and like you can do whatever you want. This tutorial will just help you do anything, but um, if you just find a good texture, and this was a very good one, save it to your desktop. I've already got saved to mine. Open up your Photoshop, and I'll create a new one because that's the old one, and we want to make it 512 by 512 because it's always good to set it to the power of two. Drag in the fence we got, like that, and then in your channels you'll only have red, green, blue, and RGB. What we want to do is create a new one and have an alpha channel. And literally, what we're going to do for this is we basically need in the alpha channel that everywhere that's black or everywhere that's white, should I say, on here needs to be black, and everywhere that's your actual your actual metal where you want to be able to see it needs to be uh, white. So let's quickly set that up. So I've just got this. And like that. And that's everything selected. So just using the magic wand tool or any other method you have, just select everywhere that you want to be um, that needs to be transparent. Go into your alpha map and then click select inverse and then color everywhere that's going to be visible. So now you've got black, which is representing your transparency, and white, that's representing what's going to be visible. Right, so save that out. So when you save this out, go file, save as, save as a target. I'm going to call it fence. I think that will overwrite a file I already have. Save. Yep. Click OK. And make sure you set it to 32-bit. If you set 24-bit, it will not register your alphas. Set it to 32-bit. And click OK. When you've done that, jump back into Unreal. Let's delete the one we got because that was my practice. And throw in the one you just saved out. There you go. There it is. Right click it and we're going to create material with it. There it went. Double click the material that's made. So far you'll just have pretty much that with a white background. All you got to do is set it to masked and then drag this channel, your alpha channel, to opacity mask. And there you go. That's pretty much done. If you have seen my other tutorials, you'll understand how to do a tiling texture, but I'll do it anyway. So hold U and left click, you'll get a texture coordinate, and then connect that up to your UVs. And then just set this how high you want to then tile your texture across. Let's apply that. Get the material we just made and apply it to this. And done. We have successfully made the alphas for our map. It's not very pretty at the moment because there's no uh, normals or roughness on it or even a metalness map, but it was quickly showing you how to do the alpha masks. The one over there does. But yeah, that's pretty much how you set up your alpha masks. I hope this helped anyone that didn't know how to do it or didn't know how to just set it up in Unreal. Uh, thank you for watching. Leave a comment if you want me to do a tutorial on something you don't know how to do. Um, thank you very much and bye bye.